<clears throat> so all, all these religions <clears throat> have the world on on intellect lockdown. You know, religion kills creativity, kills free thinking. It, it blinds you, you know, it's a filter to reality. It filters reality. Duh. You know, it stops people from seeing the truth. And <clears throat> these religions also make people tolerate the darkest shit on the, in, in the planet. You know, because religions say, oh, you know, you know, all this darkness in the world is just a sign of judgment day. And... <laughs> And so, you know, these people are ready to be killed and raped and destroyed. And, and they'll just say, they'll just say, you know, judgment day is getting closer. And, and the worse it gets, they'll, they'll just keep saying, okay, you know, it's getting closer and closer. The worse, worse and worse, judgment day is getting closer and closer. Yeah, that's the whole point of religion is so people people will, will now put up with the darkest shit because that's what their religion told <laughs> and and uh, You know, another thing that's wrong is you know, people people interpreting you know, people having different interpretations of what they're reading. Some people interpret it this way and not, you know, others interpret it that way. You know. That's that's not a good thing. I mean, does, does God have communication problem? <laughs> I mean, God didn't e explain himself clearly, right? So God should work on his writing. I mean, is that what it is? <laughs> I mean... So God, this infinite being, does not know how to express himself clearly. That doesn't make any sense. Because some stuff is just hard to understand it. Some people take it very literally. Some people try to look at the meanings. Some people, you know. But. So it doesn't make sense. So this, so this infinite being does not know how to express himself clearly. That, does, that doesn't make any sense at all. Then. top of that <clears throat> you know you'll run into a random chapter or a verse and it just sounds really fucking stupid <laughs> like really stupid I mean well, well, what happened did God did God make a mistake or something I mean come on man. no yeah oh yeah you're questioning the book that's that's the, the whispers of the devil <laughs> That's fucking stupid, man. <sighs> well, what else is wrong with religious books? Oh yeah, another thing, it's always you that's wrong. Oh, you know, if, you know, pray to God and he'll answer the prayer. Oh, you weren't praying hard enough. Oh, you were praying the wrong way.
oh, you prayed hard enough, but it didn't work, so maybe you, you, you're, you're committing some sin. It's just all a bunch of bullshit. You know, and plus, these religions also have the wrong idea about karma. They assume if something bad happens to you, it's because you, you deserved it. But that doesn't make any sense, because we are in the dark world, where, you know, Satan rules over Earth. And, of course, they're going to give good people a hard time, but that doesn't mean it's their karma. And then, and then there are those who are evil, and they serve the dark system, and they get rewarded with materialism. And then people will call that good karma or lucky, so they, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> You know, all, all these, all these religions are all pointing the finger at each other. You know, they're saying, no, we're the chosen ones and you're the damned ones. No, we're the chosen ones, you're the damned ones. And, and that's all by design. To keep the people divided. Divided and conquered. Oh, but the Bible was, uh, you know, over time people changed or whatever book, Bible or whatever, you know, over time, you know, this stuff was changed. You know, people messed around with the Bible. Now the one we have now is just the one that's been messed with. And okay then, if God is so infinite and mighty, then why didn't he stop the Bible from being messed with? That doesn't make sense. You know. What else? You know, the Bible tells you what's right and what's wrong, but if Jesus died for our sins, then well, why does it matter if, if what, what, what we're doing is right or wrong? That makes no sense. You know, they say that Jesus died for our sins, but then at the same time, <laughs> they're saying, do good, go to heaven, or if you're bad, then you go to hell. Then then why did he die for the sins? I mean, that doesn't make any sense.